This is the fourth presidential election for Ethiopia since the ruling EPRD party took power 22 years ago, replacing the incumbent Germol de Gorgis, the former ambassador of China, and recently Turkey, Dr. Mulatu Tashoma, became the new president of the Eastern Africa country. <laughs> President Mulatu is one of the most senior political leaders of the country, who also served as the Minister of Agriculture and Speaker of the House of Federation. Days before this election held in the Ethiopian parliament, the public was expressing its interest even through social media as to who will take the office in which the former president stayed for two terms, that is 12 years. Of the predictions, the former Ethiopian commodity exchange ECX founder, Dr. Leni Gabrametin, the world-famous athlete Haile Gabreselasi, and the current Speaker of the House of Representatives, Abadullah Gamada, were the favorites. But it was the unexpected Mulatu Tashoma who took power. I am also confident that I can count on the full support of you members of parliament and the entire people of Ethiopia as I endeavor to meet my obligation. There are mixed views from Ethiopians about their newly elected president. Some, of course, were not even aware of the election. We will be happy if the new president is good but I didn't know about the election at all until now. As an Ethiopian, Mr. Girma has good terms, and I wish the new president to have even a better one. We have had good times under his leadership. Born in 1924, former President Girma de Gurgis left office aged 89 for retirement. In the parliamentary political system of Ethiopia, the duty of the president is mostly ceremonial. The higher power is still held by the prime minister of the country. So many expect the job of the new president, Mulatu Tashoma, won't be any different from his predecessor. Gruntala CCTV, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.